guys just chilling chilling like a villain no doubt just thought I'd come to the uh, park today we're gonna do a range test today we got the Sima X5C out here and the X5C1 I'm sorry and the Shang K Shanghai D97 that's what it's called right D97 okay and what we are going to do is like I said we're going to do a range test I want to see how far the difference is between the two you know if, if the Shanghai is further which I'm assuming it is or if it's not or you know what the total difference is we're just gonna basically put him out there and do a test and um, we what we're gonna mark him with is I have an assistant that's gonna help me I'm using the Therabands today and the green one assistant what's the green one for Sima? Sima. okay yeah the green one is for the Sima so I'm gonna launch the Sima first way down there until it dies out I, I think this is about 200 meters so I should definitely you know be able to get some range and then my assistant's gonna go ahead and mark where the Sima lands with the green Theraband so you know it's gonna show you the range and then right after I'm going to launch the Shanghai Shang, Shanghai I'm sorry I don't know how to say that Shanghai D97 and then my assistant's going to use the blue Theraband to mark that so without further ado this is the range test between the Shanghai D97 and the Sima X5C1 let's get it started Okay, go ahead, assistant, get your stuff ready. I'll get mine ready. And um, you can go ahead and go way down there if you want, because uh, after I launch this, you know, you're going to have to pick it up and, and mark it with the Theraband and the rocks. All right, yeah, cool. <clears throat> okay, so my assistant, he is heading down there. It's got to be a cool one for you guys. I don't know if you can see it, but definitely uh, we're doing this, you know. This is the range test. So let's uh let's see how let's see how far uh, we actually get with the with the Sima here. Okay. So I'm wondering if, if it matters if I go on high speed or low speed. Um, let's get it popping. So you guys ready for this? Let's go. Okay, so I'm just sending the Sima out there. Sima's out there. Sima's out there. <laughs> okay, well. Sima. <laughs> it looks like Sima ran into something, a tree. So go ahead and put the. There you go, put the Theraband on the rock down there. Okay, so it looks like my assistant is, um, yeah, I would probably say this is about a 50, the Sima probably hit about 50, 45 to 50 meters launch. We'll go ahead and, uh, we'll go ahead and, and my, my assistant, he's bringing back the quad to me and he actually put the marker to mark down where the Sima went. So, uh, yeah, like I said, we probably got about 50 yards. I mean, it seemed like it was really high but I didn't want it to get away from me and then it kind of dipped so I'm, I'm probably saying that this is probably the 50 meters that everybody says uh, that the Sima did you put the did you put the the Theraband down cool what do you think about 50 meters it looked like it was really high I kind of had to cut it down because I didn't want it to like get away and go into that other yard or something did you see that so but I'm gonna say that's about the range so okay we got Sima. So now we are going to go ahead and try the Shanghai Shanghai D97. So let's see if the Shanghai gets a little bit, bit more down there. Sima gave us about 50 meters. So I'm imagining this one's going to probably get a little further. So let, let's go ahead and start this. Are you ready? Let's go. Okay, guys. So this is the Shanghai, which looks to me to be like a a Sima clone. So what I'm doing now is I ha and, and on both these I have the camera and the landing gear the landing feet on. I don't have the prop guards. So and fully charged batteries and and full batteries in the transmitter as well. So now we are going to go ahead and test the Shanghai. So let's go ahead. Oh wow. Look at this thing. So let's go ahead and it looks like oh yeah, definitely. I think the Shanghai's 
Wow! Actually, I'm incredibly surprised. The Saima actually, from what I see, the Saima beat the Shanghai. I'm, I'm, I'm actually, uh, I was actually really surprised by that. Wow. The, Sh the Saima was able, looks like the Saima got about maybe, geez, what is that, 50, 60 meters? And the Shanghai got about, geez, 35? Didn't really launch off at all, you know, so. Let me go ahead and I'll, I'll show you uh, what we got out of this test. And if we have more time, I mean, I can do another another quick one to see. But I'm, I'm really surprised that the Shange died out as soon as it did. Let's go ahead and uh, see that. I'll go ahead and walk down there and let you guys... Uh... Actually, what I'm going to do now, guys, is I'm going to take it off the head strap. And I'll just hold it with my hands. And I... Wow! <laughs> that was crazy that the, the Saima got further, huh? Yeah, turn it off, dude. You could turn that one off and make sure it turned out in the Sima. I gotta walk down here and show them uh, where where it went. So the so the the Sima went over by the table, right? Yeah. And the, and this one went over here. Okay. Wow, dude. So so the Sima actually got further. Well, guys, this was a live range test, and I and like I said, I launched Sima first, and um, it looks like Sima beat the. Shange D97 out. If I don't know if you can see on my uh, on my phone, but to the left, it's kind of hard. Where I'm pointing over there somewhere, there's a table. If you see it, the table like right there. That's where the Sima went, and the Shange actually died out <laughs> further. So like I said, I'm still walking. We're still walking, still walking. I think okay. Now I see it. Watch. Let me show you guys. Theraban. So, this is where the Shanghai landed, if you can see. Okay, so there's the blue rock right there. That is uh, that is the Shanghai D97. Okay, so this was the range test with that. So that's where it, it just died out and fell down. The Saima, on the other hand, had a little bit of range. Like I said, if, if you see this, uh, there's like a picnic table over there. So let's go ahead and go to this picnic table. I don't know if you guys could see that, but wow. So okay, that was Shange down there. So I'm gonna say it looks like Simon got. Geez, I would probably say Shange. This is a pretty long strip. That's why I came out here. I I, I knew both of you know. I knew either of them was gonna make it all the way down this strip. So Shange got over there with the blue uh, Theraband, which we had used as a marker. And if and we're, we're keep walking, I I can see. Sima now. I could see the green Theraband from Sima. So definitely Sima got, gee, Sima got probably about a good 25, I'm going to say this is about a good 25 meters. So here's Sima, if you see Sima Theraband right there. So yeah, it's it definitely, you know, it got some, wow, what a trip. Well, for the range test between the Sima and the uh, Sima X5C1 and the Shange D97, we did this live, and I'm going to say the Sima probably eclipsed it by about a good 20 to 25 meters. I'm going to say the Shange maybe probably got 35, 40 meters, and the Sima's probably sitting at about 60, maybe 15 to 20 meters. So let's say Shange is about 40 meters, and I'm going to give Sima about 55 to 60. So if you see now... <clears throat> I'll pick up the Sima one. We were right here, and from where I picked up the Sima one, I'll walk back. If I can remember where the the Shange one is, it's somewhere over here. But yeah, it was. It definitely was way earlier than the Sima. Wow, what a trip, though. I did not uh, expect that to happen, but it did. We're still looking. It's somewhere over here. I wish my assistant would have unfolded them a little more so I could see them, but that's okay. I'll go ahead and I'll find it somewhere. So let's see, let's see. But yeah, it was actually, it, it actually surprised me that it died out rather, rather early as it did. That was a uh, awfully weird, you know, awfully weird. Okay, let's see. I'm trying to find it now. Let's uh, 
Let's see, guys. But yeah, so there's that picnic table is where uh, Simon landed. I'm gonna back up now, and we're we're going to see where uh, where Shange landed. Shange's somewhere over here. Okay, Shange's over here. Look. So wow, look at the difference. There's there's Shange D97 over there. So then if you want to go up and if you see that picnic table somewhere right over there about Sima was about you know maybe five meters above you know above that so from the picnic table to right here you know if you look that way that that's probably about a good another 15 that might even be another 25 meters 20 to 25 meters so I'm gonna say Shange today hit about 35 to 40 meters and let's give Sima about ee, maybe 60 65 I could be wrong I, I could be saying maybe this Shange <clears throat> died out a little sooner than I thought it did so this might be at about 30 meters and picnic table Sima over there might be at about 50 to 55 so with that said it looks like the winner in the range test of the Shange D97 versus the Sima X5C1 was actually the Sima. I know people always complain about the range issues with the Sima, but in this case, the Sima won. So, not all clones are created equal, are better than the original. In this case, the range is less. I don't know about any of the other features. It seemed to elevate and fly nicely, but definitely just, boom, died out within. 30, 35 meters. Sima at least got me about 50 or 55. So with that conclusion, if you're looking for a Sima clone, you know, you might want to look at other ones. I, I mean, for the price that I had got this for, I, I still consider it a good buy, but for what it's at now at the same price as the the Sima, you're probably better off getting the Sima. I mean, you know. I mean, of course, this one does offer the FPV and some of them extra features, but range-wise, the Sima did win today, and maybe I'll do another test again in the future. I might even just do one here right after this, but we are going to go ahead and say Sima. So with that said, Sima X5C1 in a range test versus the Shanghai D97. Sima eclipsed it by probably 20 to 25 meters. All right.